Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to show you guys how to make a pom-pom pet. These are really cute and they're really easy to make. For materials you'll need at least one pom-pom and you can decide what size you want to use. You'll need some googly eyes. I have two different sizes in here. A pair of scissors. Some colorful craft foam. And actually my friend made this one. I think I made the other two. This is a little girl and she has pigtails so Pipe cleaners are optional if you want to do something like that. You could even make a hat or something or a bow. Oh, um, you can make a little bow out of ribbon. Beads to put on pipe cleaners. You'll also want a hot glue gun, and I'm usually not a fan of hot glue, but for this project it works really well. And it's not a good idea to be using hot glue on your couch, but I'm going to be careful because it's just, oh, isn't a good idea. Make sure you have some newspaper or scrap paper or something down underneath this because it drips when it's heating up. The first step is to pick out a color of pom-pom that you want to use for the body. I'm going to use this light blue one and then pick out what color of craft foam you'd like to use for the feet. Take your piece of foam and cut out a shape for the feet. Your shape doesn't have to be perfectly symmetrical and usually I cut out a basic shape first and then I trim it down a little and add toes. Here's the foot shape that I decided on. Actually your first step could be to plug your glue gun in and get it warmed up because it does take a couple minutes for those to heat up. When you have your feet and your pom-pom you're going to get your hot glue gun and you're going to put some right here in the middle and stick your pom-pom on. So while the glue is heating I'm going to give you some ideas of what you could use these for. I think the first time I ever saw these was at my uncle's. He had one like on his computer desk or something. This is optional but you can find some adhesive to stick on the bottom of these like maybe double sided tape and you can use them as an office decoration for those of you who have an office job or you can just use them in your room on your desk or on your computer. Probably for younger kids they could just use them as little toys and like play in dollhouses with them or whatever you want to do and you could also use them for game pieces if you make different colored ones or if you make a whole lot you can make a checkerboard out of them so just be really creative or a chessboard. Once the pom-poms glued onto the feet it's time to hot glue your eyes on to the pom-pom as well and I'm making a little buddy right here too he's gonna be really cute. Here's my normal size pom-pom buddy he's all complete here is the little pom-pom buddy that I made, and I put my little bow on top of its head. You know, I'm still not a fan of hot glue at all. You can only attach like one thing at a time because it dries or hardens really quickly, and it's stringy and it just is messy. You can also burn yourself on it, I know, just be careful, but uh, I don't know. I just don't like hot glue, sorry. So if you can find a better glue, let me know. Then basically anything else that you'd want to attach to these, you'd have to glue on. For instance, if you want to put pigtails on, cut the pipe cleaner like over here and then glue that on. You could put these little beads on the end of the pipe cleaner and they'll actually just stay on there. You don't have to like glue them on. So now I have two of them with pigtails, yay. And here's all the ones I have so far. I hope you guys like this idea. It's pretty simple, really easy to make. Add me on Twitter, Tumblr, and Formspring. Also, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. That will let you know when I post new videos. I will see you guys soon. Bye!